What's up, you guys? It's Volleyball and the Perfume Doll back at you with another fragrance review. So, I wanted to let you guys know about now three dupes that I own. Yes, this is another, another, another one. dupe video for Baccarat Rouge. And you know what's crazy? I still don't own the OG, but I've smelled it a million zillion times, so I know the DNA. And I want to get to three dupes. The best dupe that you guys need to go out and get because, um, why not? And then as you can see, we have my co-host, The Trash. Hey girl, how you doing? But anyways, okay, so the first one, I kind of feel like this video is beating a dead horse. Like, beating it up because, oh my God, people talk about this all the time, but when I got this new fragrance, that's really what prompted me. I feel like I had to come on here and give you guys this video. But the first one, in case you don't know, girl, I'm sure everybody know, but whatever. It's Ariana Grande Cloud. Ariana Grande Cloud. I always like when I talk about her fragrance on my channel, because that's literally the only time that I ever spray her, spray this fragrance. But as you know, it's so, so nice. It's so nice. It's a light, airy scent. Okay, so for the Ariana Grande scent, this one has a lavender. It has pear when it opens up. It kind of adds a youthful, juicy, um, almost like um, a, a sweetness to it. The the calming element and the comforting element is going to come from the lavender in there. That's in the opening as well. It, has, it says it has bergamot in the opening, but literally it doesn't smell like there's any freaking bergamot when you first smell this fragrance. Like legitimately let me spray it one more time like i don't smell any bergamot maybe the slightest amount slightest amount but a lot of fragrances open with bergamot but this one really doesn't have any element of citrus or zesty to me so which is a plus for me because i'm not a huge citrus zesty kind of a girl okay now in the middle notes it has coconut it has vanilla orchid it has praline and also has whipped cream so it just has that like almost like a sweet gourmand element to it um which is really really likable i would say i don't know if i would call this a gourmand scent because it's still it's light and fluffy almost reminds me of freaking marshmallow i was shocked this didn't have any marshmallow in it because it literally smells like marshmallow to me the base notes are just going to be woodsy and musky you don't get a lot of it though usually musky can turn a fragrance very like older grown woman type but this one is actually it still stays very very youthful so that's for the ariana grande do i think it smells like um baccarat rouge i do i do and like i told you guys i smelled ariana grande cloud first and then i heard the comparison to baccarat so i made my way making my way downtown not about to drop a bag but about to smell that fragrance and i literally this is actually bothering me today let me put something in front of because actually, you know, you're actually bothering me today. You're getting on my nerves. I'm going to put a plan in front of me. God, so much better. Oh my God. If you guys ever watched my um, earlier videos, then that's why I used to put those plants there because my trash is there. And you know what? I actually did try to move my trash. I tried to move it outside. My freaking neighbor went Blitzo Creek. Blitzo Creek. Is that the song? Boy, if you don't get... Blitzo Creek? I don't know. Anyways, went blitz on me and freaking told the freaking property owner that I was putting my trash outside. And I was like, uh, leave me alone. But anyways, and then she started doing it. She started doing it next. And I was like, you know what? Let me take my little picture so I can report you next time you report me. So I tried to get out the frame by doing that. That was a fail. I tried to put it into uh, my closet, which is right there. There's a, a closet right there. And... That was a fail too, because it started getting all stonky in there. And I was like, that's my coat closet. And I can't have my coats be smelling all stonky. I'm not trying to pay for 30 coats to be dry cleaned. And how many shoes? Oh my God. So I have to take it out of there. And now I'm actually doing the process of getting the odor out of there. So I'm like, where am I going to put my trash? I guess you said I could actually put it in a trash can. But I feel like trash cans are so ugly. But I guess not uglier than a trash bag sitting there. I don't know. What do you think I should do? Tell me what to do, you guys. That's what we want. We want to grow up to be adults so then people can tell us what to do because we didn't want it when we were kids. Now we want guidance. But anyways, 
Ariana Grande Cloud. So I made my way. I smelled Cloud first. Then I made my way to Neiman Marcus, I believe it was, to smell Baccarat Rouge. And yes, I do think they're similar. I think that Ariana Grande's Cloud is a lighter, fluffier interpretation without the, not as much depth. It hints at depth with the woody notes, with the muskiness, with even the lavender. It gives it like herbalness and cleans the skin a little bit better um, and gives a little bit more complexity than just like a childish, light, airy, fun cloud, uh, marshmallow, sugary type scent. But I think the Baccarat Rouge still has an element of sexy that the cloud doesn't have. But I think they're both really, really great. And do I think they smell very similar? Yes. But that's only to people that are just, you know, just smelling them. To people that are like, you know, weird like us. We're weird. It's okay. Fragrance community. That's why you're here. You know, we have that commonality. That are really smelling it. I smell the difference that the Baccarat is. has that sexy note. That leads me to the next one so the next one that i have that is a dupe that i've tried is a body oil and it's from vision that body oils is this ink coming off I'm making sure it's not coming off my couch oof i've had the hardest time keeping this freaking couch white and it's not even cloth i don't know is it me am i a slob i don't know what do you guys use to keep these kind of couches white because i am feeling all right so this oil this oil first of all performance girl performance the dolls love performance i think it smells so good i think it does smell like it um i think it smells like the muskiest part of baccarat rouge and this is the baccarat rouge from vision that body oils which is based in detroit michigan but they do sell online they actually have like really good deals for the you can get like three of these for five bucks you know really really good deals but this oil i feel like it does smell like baccarat rouge but it has like the muskier elements which also this is the plus that it can translate to being like the sexier component so if you want something that's a dupe but a little bit of like sexier than Ariana Grande, but still keeping the Baccarat Rouge DNA, then I would suggest this one. And then also if you just prefer oils, then I would suggest this one. As you can see, I like it because I have put a dent in her. And I'm like, oh my God, I'm gonna have to get another one because it is actually really, really good. Yeah, almost smells like a candied, oh, it smells like a candied fruit. And it has like that, intense muskiness that is like really really sexy all right and then the next one that i want to talk about is one that was full transparent full full transparency it was sent to me uh i think it was sent for freaking poland i think it was sent for poland what up poland do i have any people watching me from poland has anyone been to poland how is it are the guys hot is the food good the weather's trash right that's okay i'm from up north i'm i'm used to trash weather it doesn't deter me actually i would take some well, you know, here's the thing with trash weather. It's great because it's easier to warm up than to try to take off clothes in the summertime to cool down. Like you can only take off so many clothes. You're sitting there bucket naked and then it's still hot outside. In the winter, you can always put on another jacket, another sweater. You can always put on more blankets, you know, cozy. But that's why I prefer winter. But the trade-off is that, oh my God, you get stuck in inclement weather. You know, it's it's hailing, it's freaking snowing, it's ice, you're running off the road. You're screaming for God, you're losing your life. So that's the only reason I'll take, um, I guess, warmer weather is better. All right, this fragrance, sent from Poland. It's from Frederico Mahora from Poland. Okay, maybe it just sounds nice. I understand, I've changed my name too. But this is from the line called Pure Royal look it's very difficult to find information about this brand i found it's like 10 different websites for the same brand so i don't know i'll leave if i can find it the information below but they are very affordable i won't name the price because i saw a bunch of different prices too but very affordable i want to say under 50 that's not bad that's comparable to the celebrity scent the ariana grande cloud okay um, but yeah, so this is a 1.7 fluid ounce. This is how it comes. Nice presentation, right? This is hunter green. It's like etched in, is it embossed? Yeah, it is embossed in gold. Very, very nice. But like their scents are going to be, what's it called? Impressions? Impressions? Usually inspired, inspired by designer scents. And this is inspired by Baccarat Rouge. This is Frederico Mahora Pure Royal line. And this is the their numbers. That's how they're um, 
distinguish their number and this is the 910 okay pure royal 910 and this is how it comes in the bottle again you see that that's actually pretty nice right very nice i think for the price point which is actually pretty affordable i hope i'm not quoting you wrong but look 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 look, look, look. come 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 here you guys when i freaking sprayed this i was like oh my god baccarat <sighs> something juicy something tart about this i don't know this has like this is like baccarat rouge intensify the juicy intensify the juicy intensify like the sweet a grown woman succulent sweet sensual type baccarat rouge still a little bit sweet but like elegant this is like pure elegance something about this screams nighttime but you know what you can get away with it in the daytime because i got away with it i got away with it i wore it today i got away with it oh, this smells really 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 good y'all i've been testing her putting her to the test it's hot outside this is the ultimate test for fragrances it is hot when it's really hot really cold that's the ultimate test for your fragrances it's, it's pretty warm it's 80 temperature rising i was sitting in direct heat i wore this to bed all night 10 hours yeah i sleep 10 hours don't judge 10 hours woke up this fragrance was still there hello she's there it was still there the performance is there dude i don't know something about this screams i don't know you can kind of feel also in a fragrance when you spray it let me know comment below do you agree you can feel in a fragrance when it has a higher oil concentration yay or nay i feel like this one does it literally lasts it lasts i like it i like it like i like it like that it's really really good so you know those are the three dupes that i have in my collection i should just wear them all together one day just smell like a freaking not a snack an entree babe an entree i really like those Ooh. Yeah, you know what? Cloud kind of turns a little bit herbal. I don't know. Something about cloud, it takes on the woody, lavender, musky aspects after a while when you wear it. This one retains the candied sexiness. Oh, really, really nice. Really, really nice. The, the oil, what is that on me? Oh, hair. The oil retains the sweetness and the muskiness. And it's kind of like they all take aspects of the Baccarat Rouge DNA. But like, I don't know. I don't know how you guys feel about dupes or impressions or whatever. Inspired. But look, when I tell you, when I tell you, it's really good. I'm telling you, it's good. Have you guys tried this brand? Have you heard of it? Please let me know. Because I'm actually, which way is it? I'm holding it the wrong way. Let me know, have you tried anything else from this brand? Because I'm so curious and I like want to order something. So let me know and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.